Let's make a soup. And I wanna mix the bread and the milk for a thing that's called the white gazpacho. Everybody knows gazpacho as like a garden soup with lots of tomatoes and garlic and cucumber. But this one's a little different. It's a white gazpacho. There's lots of almonds and grapes in it. So there's one way to get the white gazpacho really nice and thick, and that's by taking some bread and soaking it in milk. Whatever bread you want, dale bread, sourdough, rye, just get some bread and milk and get it soaking. You want your bread that's been kind of soaked. You don't want to do this with dry, fresh bread because it won't work. You're just going to make like a weird pizza dough kind of thing. So start with the bread. And I love this because it has nuts in it. And I'm a little bit nutty. And this one calls for blanched slivered almonds, the only nut I use in this soup. Just gives you a really nice consistency. And I love the taste of almonds. Also, big pinch of salt and 10 twists of pepper. Maybe 15. You need that pepper in there and the salt to kind of season it because the thing about white gazpacho is there's not too many ingredients in it. So the limited ingredients that it has, you really gotta go bonkers with that stuff to make it really nice and tasty. So you get the bread, the almonds, salt, pepper, the milk, a few grapes for a little bit of sweetness and then just a little bit of fresh garlic and blend it. While it's blending, I like to add olive oil to it. It really gives it this nice silkiness and a really cool shine. You want a good quality olive oil, don't be shy. So good. Okay, soups are all about balance. And every time I make a soup, I always put a splash of vinegar in it and it gives you that piquant feel and it really balances the whole thing out. Just a little splash of vinegar is gonna make any soup in the world really exciting. It's so nice and creamy. All right, check this thing out, it's so cool. Oh, it smells delicious. So cool, and this is classically served cold. I don't heat it up, it's delicious like that. It's so good, just a little kiss of sherry vinegar at the end, delicious. And anytime I make a soup, I like to garnish it because soups are usually kind of pureed, so if I put some garnishes on it, it gives some excitement to it. So a little bit of olive oil, some dried parsley, just for effect, and it looks pretty, and it goes really well with almonds and grapes and bread and lots of seasoning, yummy. Just a few grapes, add a little pop of color, and when you're eating the soup, you get a big, bold grape, delicious. Even a few almonds right at the end. Yes, look at that. That soup looks just delicious. Try it, you're gonna fall in love with it.